You're quite close. Yay, I got it this time. <laughs> Not even a point in jumping, just to let it kick us out and it's pretty much be perfect. It's gonna suck if the event pass, like the last airbender one, sucks. Like they just have like the dumbest, worst cosmetics themed around the show or whatever. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if Aang is the only one that ends up in the pass. I want to say there could be a possibility that they put two skins in the pass. But it's somewhat unlikely. I'd be lame. I really hope it's not so something like that, because that, that should be like an edit style. You were about to get angry at me snatching that. <laughs> I knew it. That's the only reason why I grabbed it as quick as I possibly could. Come on, give me water bending, bitch. Actually grab that I like how there's a chest that's like almost guaranteed to be in storm by the time you get to it right now. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Yeah. It probably will be added to the mini map when the uh, iceberg shifts like like right next to the island like when it goes like all the way over there <laughs> you said the way you said that you said laid off hitler like he just like got put out of his job hey i got splashes are you deliberately killing yourself to storm laid off hitler What are you doing this for? <laughs> I don't know exactly what your full plan is, but I mean, ruining is fun. Despite the fact that chronologically the timing of all this doesn't make sense, you still like the still shows to do this iceberg anyway. The Avacom. I just switched out my entire load out here. I'm just stealing all the loot. Yay, I got water bedding. The primal joy I get from when I collect this is so ridiculous. And it's probably hilarious to you. What? What was the plan? <laughs> you do realize if I didn't heal you up, you just would have died, but even further from where the edge of storm was. 
with your route of getting up. Since you chose to go fully around the freaking storm. Thanks for the med kit, bro. <laughs> no! Thanks for giving me something that you can cringe over. If only I was able to record the Discord calls. <laughs> Thanks for letting me know. You should just leave your mic unmuted so then I could still like record you. If I were to do like a stream or something like that. I'm supposed to like go into the final blow with the water bending item. I hate how just like other items that heal you in uh, water, this does not heal you in storm at all. You know, what logical sense does it make that you're able to heal in water just by having the ability to water bend? I don't really understand that. Honestly, what I find most funny is the fact that in the universe of Avatar, people are able to use telekinesis, but only on very specific things that is sometimes not as specific. And it's just really random. Like, how does one actually genuinely obtain the ability to have telekinetic abilities, but it only works on very specific things? Like a very specific thing and things relating to it. Similar to like water could pro like bend ice and shit. Well, realistically, couldn't you bend steam as a water bender and then make it seem like you're an air bender? It's still a form of water. Dude, it's not my fault the show is so flawed, man. The whole bending thing is flawed to the extremes. And let's not even get on to the whole thing where, like, there's the whole metal stuff. I know, but still. <laughs> I mean, just the fact that it's already specified to certain stuff. Like, bending fire is so ridiculous. And then... Where does the fire just come from, though? They're able to just conjure up fire. Earthbenders have to use the ground. Airbenders have to use the existing air. Waterbenders have to use the existing water. Firebenders just summon fire. No, but why can they summon it? Why can't Earthbenders literally create islands? <laughs> no, I, I know it's useful, but why is it possible? There really weren't any good colors, so that's why I just went for this like gray and like different shades of blue. <laughs> you were the one driving. I'm pretty sure that directly states the fact that it's your fault. Dude, I have the dumbest loadout for someone whose aim isn't perfect. I my guns are a hand cannon. A pump shotgun and water bending. I guess what I just found for you. <laughs> we just 
just like waiting for me to break the window, or did you just not realize I was in the car? I hope one of these days, Fortnite does an April Fool's joke where the game works a lot like Goat Simulator, so you like ragdoll just from like falls. Everyone's like invincible. Unless you get like launched out to the death barrier. That's the only thing that kills you. And passengers could honk and boost the car that they're in. Oh, dude, it would be so hilarious if there was like a mega collab between the simulator and Fortnite for April Fools. Oh yeah, most definitely. I mean, the entire, like, the only other time that Ghost Simulator really collabed with the game, they made an entire DLC. Ooh, sweet ride for us. <laughs> Don't mind if we do. Honestly, if this car didn't cost as much, I'd buy it. If this costed like 2,800, like the other car did, I probably actually would buy it to be honest, despite how ridiculous the 2,800 price would be. I find it funny because for me it feels slower riding in here. <laughs> and we got enemies behind us as well in that building. We just don't know about it yet. Uh oh, those people found out about us now. I guess how I just got shot from the other thing. They're still over there. They're shooting at us. Bro. No, there's a third party. No, I was trying to get behind cover so I could use a banana. If you're able to survive... I don't think you're surviving this. You didn't set me down on top of the car. <laughs> the fact that you're still alive is astonishing. <laughs> Batman Ducks 81. Uh, <laughs> Dude, if the car blows up and then you take one fire damage, that's just it for you. And all the wheels seem to be broken. No, just the left ones. Dude. Please tell me you have healing. Med kit before you reboot. The storm's moving. Jesus fuck, you're gonna kill yourself. Dude, if I can glide over and get my stuff back, it's gonna be hilarious. Should I try to go for it? There's like a war going on over there. Someone was flying with wings just waiting for me. So the moment I landed, they like freaking hit me and then gunned me down. And I only had a great pistol. Hehehe. <laughs>